Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. We'll have every kick of the ball for you live on EA TV. Hello, good evening to you, and part of the story here is the Albite Stadium by night, 60,000 capacity here. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone, and sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson, and really looking forward to bringing you this World Cup Round of 16 match. It's Brazil versus the Korea Republic. Absolutely, this should be a good game. I think both sides deserve to be here. But whichever team plays to their full potential should make it into the quarterfinals. It's going to be a good game. The starting 11 for Brazil. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Thiago Silva plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Casemiro plays with Fred in central midfield. And the responsibility of leading the line today goes to Neymar. And the South Korea starting 11. Yeah, the same formation and the same sort of game plan. So this will all be about which individuals can get the better of their opponent. This will be a tough battle. And the game begins. Well, Brazil are the best World Cup team in history. Five times winners. Always amongst the favourites. This year is no exception. And they're in the round of 16, not just to compete, but to win it all, Stuart. Absolutely. Everybody expects Brazil to go further. They've played some great football so far. They're also being quite good defensively. They know how they want to defend when they haven't got the ball. They're a good side. I think they can go all the way. But this is a big game for them. Well, moving the ball impressively here. But then the one that fails to hit its target. A real struggle to contain him. Vinicius Junior. Huang Ui Jo. And a very good challenge. Rafinha. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Good physical play. Doesn't want to lose his cool here. And that'll be a Brazil ball. Paqueta. And a crucial intervention inside the box. Kyung Min Son. Wang He Chan. Kim Tae Hwan. They really look after the ball when they have it. And there it is! But hang on, the flag has gone up, and it's not going to count. Well, it was a close call, but he is just offside. Good finish, mind you.
Lucas Paqueta. Return to Paqueta. And it's still on. And Neymar. In it goes. The opening goal in this contest. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, but you do have to ask questions of the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't be beaten at your near post like that. And back underway. 1-0 it is. Textbook defending inside the box. Rafinha. Here's Marquinhos. Well, Brazil, as you can see, haven't enjoyed the majority of possession. But when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. It's really good without the ball and the all-around performance. And a goal! Well, this is a brilliant strike, as you can see. He hits it with so much power, the keeper had no chance. Fantastic finish. Two nil now, and back on the way. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. Juan Uijo. Continues his run. Son. Can he find the net? And it goes to reduce the deficit. Still very much alive and kicking. Managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. And they kick off here. So the second half underway, and Brazil have the lead, but plenty of time for a few twists and turns before this one is over. And a throw-in it's going to be. Paqueta. Top-class defending. Wang Hee Chan moving the ball forward with purpose. Surely the equaliser. Oh, wonderful goalkeeping. Well, you have to say, from that sort of distance, that's a wonderful save. How about the short corner? Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Quang in beyond. Can he finish this? And a goal! My goodness, they've changed the course of this game. Level now. Well, just look at this. 
He keeps his composure and he almost passes it into the back of the net. That's a very good goal. got to give credit to the entire team because this was a bit like climbing Mount Everest Neymar Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. Well, neutrals are getting their money's worth. 3-2 in this match. Wang Hee-chan. It's with Wang Uijo. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. So the ball rolling again at three all. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Juan Uijo. Now Son. And he could really get at the opposition. Must take the lead here. And they have, you've got to say, it has been coming. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And Son finds that bit of space in the box to finish so clinically. That's an excellent goal. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Rafinha. Here is Fred. They get forward, but time is very much against them here. And Neymar. Great opportunity. Well, it's the late show, and they are level again. Well, here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. And level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. They're on the scent of a winner late in this game. And threading it forward. Oh, a goal! And is that going to be the one that wins it for them?
There's every chance, and the fans are lapping this up. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. Extraordinary scoreline. Does this game have more goals in it? Well, they're attacking, but time is the great enemy. And the referee blows for full time. They've made it through to the last stage of the World Cup. Well, going forward, their one and two touch passing was excellent, and they created so many opportunities but they will certainly need to improve their defensive structure going into the next round. But it just seems that this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.